to kick things off on stage too is a guy who's gotten closer to that million dollars than any of the other athletes tonight. This is Colorado rock climber Ian Dory. He came within inches of finishing stage three two years ago, and he's one of the favorites to get back there. And there's his wife Jessica holding their baby Olivia, only a couple of months old, and Ian's mom has their two-year-old son Pax. All right, here we go. And you see that clock in the corner counting down the four minutes. And Dory's a guy a lot of people have picked to go all the way to stage four this year. But he needs to use his climbing skills right here on the giant ring swing. He needs to grab that middle ring and jump it across. It's important to get through this obstacle quickly without using a lot of time or strength. You can see how high those hooks are. He now has this 18-foot swing to the landing, and he's through. And there's Megan Martin, one of the end's Wolfpack trading partners. You got this, Now it's this redesigned crisscross salmon ladder. They have to jump the bar up eight rungs, but also go back and forth across the two sides. Dory's real dope on this. He's going to show us how it's done. Now it's to turn around and jump to the other side. Got it. Oh, bar's uneven. Uh-oh, check it out. A rare misstep for Dory. Turn around and go back to the other side. He is using up a lot of time, though. He needs to pick this thing up. Yeah. And he's through. And there's no rest in between. Has to work his way over to the next obstacle, the wave runner. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Ooh, and this was a tough one last year. Knocked out more competitors than any other. It even took out Joe Morosky and Jesse Graff. You have to grab the sides of the board and work your way across, and those boards will tilt. This is going to test the core as well. And you go from wide to narrow. Yeah! Got it. Such a challenging obstacle. Yeah, and keeping that core tight is the secret to getting it going. And Dory gets through. Come on, All right, that clock is tick, tick, ticking. You only have four minutes to get through stage two. But up next, a new challenge. It's the swing surfer. You got to take a flying leap out and land on that pendulum. That's a 13-foot jump to get out there. His climbing skills can't help him here. Oh no! Are you kidding me? Well, what a way to start, Ian Dory, one of the top competitors, knocked out by the fourth obstacle, the swing surfer. This swing surfer is like jumping off of a rooftop. Watch this. You have to be fearless and you have to be precise. That ledge is only about a foot wide. Dory had the distance, but was offline. Only one foot landed, and his season is done. Uh.